Hi, this is a quick unboxing review of the Terra TL130H1 quadcopter. So this is the quadcopter itself, it came in a pretty tiny box. It comes ready to fly, all you need to do is just connect your receiver and bind your transmitter and you are ready to go. In the box you get in also a set of propellers, these are 8 propellers, 3 inch, 30, 20, uh, propellers, so you get eight of them. So in the box you also get in the instruction manual and you have also instruction manuals for the video transmitter which inside you can see all the bands and how to set them up. Next I'm going to show the specifications on the drone on the bottom of the box. If you would like you can pause the video and see all the specifications. So let's see what else we're getting in the box. We're getting a uh, bag with all the needed cables so let's go over them getting also a USB adapter which you're going to connect to the bow of the drone I'm going to show you how we do it later getting a strap for the battery screws for the propellers And you get in also landing pads. So let's go ahead and weigh the drone. The weight of the drone without anything as it comes, it's almost 82 grams. And if you attach the battery which I bought, which is Gen says 450 milliampere hour battery, it's almost 130 grams without the propeller so it's probably around 130 around 140 grams so let's have a look you're getting the motors are 4000 kilowatt motors by Terot the ESCs are 6 amperes also by Terot you're getting the transmitter and a JST connection on the top you can see the deep switch which we use to set the uh, uh, frequency on the rear of the board you can see on the right side is the s bus connection on the middle is PPM on the left side is the LED controller so on the top side you can see the transmitter the video transmitter is 300 milliwatt transmitter it has already an attached antenna which you cannot replace easily on the front is a parrot camera it's 600 TVL CMOS and on the top part as I mentioned is the JST connection on the right side of the drone, you can see the USB connection, which is blocked by the aluminum column. It's a bit of a problem, it is a design flow, so in order to get USB, you have to detach the column by and unscrew it, and then you will get into it. On the left side is the PWM connection. I'm going to connect the parrot to my XSR transmitter and then bind it with my Taranis. The thing I'm going to do, I'm going to connect this end to this end that will connect to the XSR receiver in order to connect it to the flight controller of the drone. So now the cable is ready and I can connect it to the flight controller. Okay so the next thing I'm going to do is going to bind the Taranis uh, transmitter to the receiver. So what we're going to do, you have to go to your model, press menu, then page, and then you can see you have to set up here the internal RF on D16 and the channel range is going to be channel 1 to 16 and then it can just set here the receiver number so mine is going to be the second one and then just press bind you can see it's blinking and transmit sound so what you need to do you have to hold the XSR button while you plug the power so I'm going to do it like that see Now the binding process has been finished, all you need to do is just disconnect the power from the XSL transmitter and you are done. 
See that now that I'm done, it's already working. I can arm the quad and it's already working. The next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to configure it with the clean flow. Okay, so have you, as you can see, I had to remove these two screws in order to get to the USB port. And then I just connect it to the supplied USB adapter. I already have a clean flight installed on my computer. And I had to install a driver, which I'm going to put on the description. And now, as you can see, it's going to connect. Okay. And then you can just go through the settings and put all the required information. It already come pre-configured to SBUS. Now, next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to add a couple of flight modes and then just go ahead and fly this thing.